welcome to Our Life HD with me, Henry. But no, Anna. Unfortunately, she shouldn't couldn't be with us this time, but um, she will be in the next one. So today we are doing pumpkin pop carving. Oh, did I say pumpkin carving? I meant butternut squash carving. So here we are with our usual every year carving with a pumpkin. This year we're going to do something different, carving with a butternut squash, which you can try at home. Um, if you are a child, I would recommend uh, parent uh, supervision, as we don't want you cutting yourself with a knife. <laughs> so yes, um, so here we are. We've got got um, some cocktail sticks, um, which I'll probably use for the mouth. Um, a tea light for the inside and some, some matches which I might probably use for when we cut out the eyes and let's see how it goes. So I'm going to start with the eyes. I mean I've never cut a butternut squash before so I mean I've had it for soup so that's as much as it I've ever made uh, a pumpkin like a yeah, butternut squash version. So, A bit stiff. Oh, this isn't easy. Maybe that's why you stick with a blue pumpkin. Bless us. Oh, I thought this was going to be easier than normal. So yeah, it's coming to table up a little bit. Oh, that's a bit better. So if you're new to this channel, please like and subscribe for more interesting things. And we look at nature parks, uh, things to do, and um, yeah, that's kind of what we look at. I mean, in my last video, we went to the Lake District and we went up Cat Bell Summit. So be sure to check that out at the end of the video. Also, I will be doing a time lapse of this video. So. If you, uh, if you find this video too long, just check out my uh, time lapse. A little bit at a time. I think it's just difficult getting through the first bit till you punctured it and then it just oh, comes out like that. Yeah, that's it. Slowly getting there. There we go. Give it a bag. Back again. Just put all of the rubbish on, keep your work area nice and tidy. Can I not have peace and quiet now for some reason? But hey, anyway. it's some of the seeds. It doesn't smell as bad as a pumpkin. There's a lot. Of, there's an awful lot of seeds in here. I don't, as I said, I don't know what to expect. I've never, I've never really cut 
Because we will need to get a tea light in there. God knows how easy that's going to be. God, it looks like it's just, it looks like just a, a very sick uh, <laughs> kind of punk at the minute. Seats everywhere. Might look better if I cut the eyes out. like to comment in below and tell me what you think would be better at, at Halloween, either a pumpkin, butternut squash, that would be great. As I do read comments at the end of the video and respond as soon as I possibly can. Do it for you viewers. On the eye, I don't want to actually take the full eye out, obviously a cut out. Um, just so I can eventually put a couple of matchsticks in. Four matchsticks in there. Well, four, four in total. And we'll light it and blow it out. Just have that sort of uh, black eye element. I'm just gonna just tidy it all off and we'll be right back. Welcome back. So just tidy managed to tidy up the eyes. I thought I'd get a teaspoon this time. I wasn't having much luck with a knife in the end. So I started tidying up the eyes and they've actually come out pretty good. So we'll roll we'll roll we'll roll we'll roll with that. So yeah, I think we think we're we're doing obviously you're on the recording and over here is the time lapse of the full video so if you're wondering why I'm looking at two cameras that's, that's why <coughs> I think um, probably doing a um, a I keep thinking it's a courgette I think that's a blue and green. Um, I keep thinking, I think a butternut squash is a bit more yucky than, than a pumpkin. Surprised how much seed is in it.
Maybe if you would. There's a lot of shit though. Um, yeah. Oh, I mean, what you could do, depending on how you are with with your um with your pumpkin or whatever you're using for this Halloween, you could even maybe use some of this this innards as maybe it, no. You know, it's kind of being sick or scenario. I mean, that would be awful, awfully disgusting, like everything, like everything at Halloween. Scary friends. Yeah. Really struggling with the bottom. The question is, I still need to get some tea lamp in. Let's see. That in there. I can't get it. At least I know it fits, which is really good. I can't get it out. Oh, yes, it did. Just a matter of twisting it. So pull it out a bit more. Well, I think that's, that's uh, pretty darn clean. So, for the next step, Rid of this crap rubbish. We will start getting our um, our cocktail sticks. I mean, these are my cocktail skewers, but you can use cocktail sticks. Snap them. Make them a bit shorter. Actually, I'll need to put the candle in first. Need a bit of grip. I haven't got any grip. So I'm just God, it's quite difficult to get um, a uh, I mean, uh, cocktail skewer in there. So I'm gonna just gonna get some gloves. Uh, couldn't find my gloves, so I'm just using a different pair of gloves. So there we go. That's better. I think it might be better to make these a bit shorter. Oh, so I'm just going to snap them. That's two teeth done. I don't know how many teeth I'll need, so I just brought spares just in case. Ugh. This isn't the easiest. I mean, that's why people, not many people do this. So. <laughs> you decide in the comments below. For my enjoyment, because I like to try new things. That's the way you learn. Oh my god.
Go oh, inside. Dropping things. Oh, that's just the way I want it, isn't it? If you hear any screaming in the video, that's just uh, somebody going football mad. Because as as today is is what day is it today? Today is Sunday. The no Sunday is Sunday of October. I can't remember. And this video will be released released on Tuesday. Oh my god, I can't, I'm really struggling getting these in. It's a real pain. It's very difficult. So, you know what? I'll be right back. Just hold fire. A couple of seconds and I'll be right back. Back again. I think I might use a knife this time. See, if that, see how, how that goes. Oh, that's much better. Bit of, maybe a, get a pair of pliers, and that that will that will help you get these uh, cocktail sticks in. Yeah, much easier. Why didn't I think of that before? Yeah, it's starting to come on now. Just cutting up a few more cocktail sticks. Nearly yeah, went through the bloody thing. So, if you're enjoying this video, please remember to like and subscribe. And remember to leave me a comment as I'll go back to them at the end of the video. And I really hope you guys are enjoying the video. Go. That's all the teeth done. That is all them teeth done. So that looks good. That looks pretty good. And next is to get some well, matches. They can be any old matches. I'm just going to use long matches because that's all I can find. Let's snap them off. About that length. Gonna need about that length. All depends on how how deep you've gone in your uh, butternut squash. So I haven't gone deep enough. And you'll probably want four four for each eye. So 
so that's eight. The one's a total of eight matches. No, I thought we'd need maybe maybe four matches. We might not even need that now. Maybe three might three might be enough. So we'll do is we'll light light that. This box, I'll have this box. Remember, parent supervision if you're under 18. Oh shit, no. Scratch them up a little bit. Oh, mad, crazy. Crazy, uh, but not squash. So, thank you very much for watching and for all your patience. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you're new to this channel. And we'll see you on the next one. And be sure to check out the couple of the videos just in the link below. Thank you. Bye-bye.